YouTube, what's going on, man? No limit, Sean. Bringing y'all another story time. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to leave my story time playlist in the description so you can watch all of them. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of pretty decent ones. Better ones coming soon, but y'all might, y'all going to fuck with this one. All right, so we're going to get into this story. This is about a time where a girl really tried to play herself and I really had to roast her, like, because she was getting out of hand. Now, in high school, I was a class clown. I used to joke around, drill people. I'm pretty good with, like, looking at somebody and just being able to, you know what I'm saying, tell who they look like and shit like that. I've I always been really good at that. And you really, nobody really can, I mean, it's stuff you can say about me, but it's like I always can come back and say something like, you have to be damn near perfect to be, like, to really say something about me and I really can't respond back. So I'm, I'm always pretty good with roasting people or, or shit like that. Okay, so this was in 2012. This was my junior year. This girl was a senior. And this girl's fucking ugly as shit. She's black as fuck. Ugly. Fat. This this nasty looking. This, I don't even know why she would even play herself and try to say any anything about me. But, okay. So this is 2012. Maybe a few months before school is about to, about to end. We're all in study hall. Now, this study hall class had about anywhere between 10 to 15 people. But today, it wasn't really a lot of people. It was probably like 9 or 10 people, including me and the girls. So, like, 8 other people and then us two. And basically, uh, uh, maybe like a week or a couple of days ago before that, her, like she was in, I guess, it's like some kind of like school program, I guess. Maybe for like up-and-coming college students. I don't know. Some type of program. And she was went to the program with my cousin. You know what I'm saying? My, my cousin, she's a female. And I guess her and my cousin end up talking or some shit like that. So, this, this was the whole... This is how everything started. So, she told the people in my class that my cousin said... Because me and my cousin live together. So, so basically, she said... She told people in my class that my cousin said I'd be going home and saying like, Oh, I'm the flyest nigga in school. I get all the hoes. That basically that's what she was saying that's what she said my cousin said i be coming home and telling her now we're gonna fast forward with that after we I, after i got into an argument with a girl i went home and asked my cousin and my cousin said she didn't she didn't say that to that girl now i don't know if she did or not maybe she did maybe she didn't but i don't think she would lie about that you know what i'm saying and she like kind of i think she messaged the girl and said why would you lie on me like that so it was the girl obviously trying to be funny i'm not sure though so we're going to rewind back. So basically, the sort of fat girl saying, my cu I be going home telling my cousin, like, yeah, I'm the flyest nigga in school. I get all the hoes. I got, you know what I'm saying? Shit like that. I be going home bragging, basically trying to lie. And you know I'm saying lie to my cousin. It's saying I do stuff in school that I really don't, basically. So she's trying to, like, basically, she's saying that. And I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, I never, I don't, I don't go home and tell her no shit like that. Like, what kind of corny shit is that? Like, I'm not, you know what I'm saying, like, I don't go home and tell her no shit like that. So she basically trying to say that, and then she's like trying to roast me. She said like some something, something like I got like she was talking about my shoulders, like I had because I have broad shoulders. So she's saying I got so she was trying trying to make jokes about my shoulders. You know what I'm saying? Trying to like roast me and shit like that. So I'm like, bitch, what? I'm and then I just went crazy on her. So I'm like, you fucking fat bitch, like you fucking ugly as shit. You don't have a fucking neck. You got a muffin top. You don't, you don't know how to dress. You don't got any edges. You barely got hair. You're fat as shit. No dude would never want you. What the fuck is you doing trying to talk about me for? You're hideous. No dude would ever talk to you. You don't like, you're fucking ugly as shit. You're fat as fuck. Stretch marks, sloppy, ugh. Like, you're just disgusting. Like, why would you even try to say anything about me? You look, look at you. Look, like you like, dude, look at yourself. Like, really, be honest with yourself. Do I? Do you really think you're cute? Like, I mean, what's going on now? Like, c come on now. Like, you don't look good at all. You're not even okay. Even if you had an extreme makeover, you still wouldn't look good. You still would be ugly. Now, I seen worse, but you're hideous. You're ugly as fuck. You don't have a neck, a muffin top, stretch marks. Well, everything no gear you like what i mean the only thing i really can say is you don't stink i mean i guess you have good hygiene but other than that i mean what else do you have you don't have a body you don't have a face i mean you're ugly i mean what <laughs> so i'm just going crazy just saying all type of shit she's not calling me ugly back so She's basically saying like, what, what the fuck she was saying? She was basically saying like, oh, fuck out of here. I, what the fuck was she saying? I thought went, she was basically, 
I'm trying to think what she was saying back because she really wasn't trying to roast me back because I hit her with so much shit. She, it was this overload. She, I think she started thinking like, damn, I am fat. I am ugly. I am black as shit. I do have a muffin top. I, I, I don't do, don't like me. So basically she's saying, oh, I know I look good. I'm like, well, see, who, who told you that? Like, you don't look good. You're ugly. Like, I mean, what don't you understand? You don't look good. No dude would never talk to you. Oh, she's like, oh, I don't care. I don't care what you say. I already know. Blah, blah, blah. Um, um, That's why your mom buys your clothes. I'm like, nigga, I'm in high school. What the fuck? I'm not 30 years old. I mean, is, is it my fault that I, I got nice stuff? I mean, are you bad, bitch? <laughs> like, what the fuck? Don't get mad because your parents buying you cheap ass shit and not buying you shit. And, and mine was. So, I mean, that's, that's your defense? My mom buys my clothes? Like, what the fuck? I'm 17. I mean, I didn't have a job or nothing. Like, what the fuck? Why not? Shit. People, parents buy them shit. You mad because your parents didn't buy you nothing? Probably because you can't fit nothing because you're so fucking big and nasty and sloppy. Oh, and then this bitch tries to squeeze in. Oh, I said that too. This bitch tries to squeeze in the Aeropostel shirts that you can't even fit. I'm like, look at your Aeropostel shirt. You can't even fit in that shit. Your fucking stomach is about to pop out. Yo I, yo, I was just really just roasting this girl like anything you could possibly say. I was just going crazy on her like and then she said some shit like I don't care. My mom, even my mom said I look good or some shit. I'm like, your mom said you look good. I'm like, she just telling you that so you don't feel bad about yourself. And she said, oh, don't talk about my mom. I'll beat your ass right now. I'm like, nigga, what are you talking about? I didn't say nothing about your mom. I said your mom tells you you look good so you won't feel bad about yourself. How am I talking about your mom? I'm talking about you still and then she basically she tried to change the subject because she was getting roasted so fucking bad you know i really was going in like this girl is hideous she's like five two black as shit fat ass cheeks muffin top this nasty sloppy this a globby mess of nothing like she's like oh 10 being oh she's bad one being she's hideous like the worst nastiest looking thing ever she's Honestly, maybe I would say a three. You know, I'm not gonna say a two. I'm gonna say a three because I have seen worse. I'm gonna give her a three, just being nice. So we're roasting each other. She's trying to fight me. Well, she didn't try to hit me or nothing like that. I think she just got up, and I think the teacher broke it up, and she called. They called a century or some shit like that. And I bet, and she, and she, um, and she really started with me. Like I basically explained to him what happened and everything like that. So I think I end up getting like a day in ISS, and then she end up getting like a whole week because she tried to fight me and she started the argument with me. So Ashley really was tripping, man. Like she really tried to play herself. Like how can you try to roast me? Like that's what I do. Like you, I know she really was. I know that night she was looking in the mirror like, damn. She probably pulled out her flappy ass stomach. Like wow, I really do have a muffin top. I'm really ugly. You no, know, Sean was really right. Damn, why? I should have never said anything about him, man. I really regret that. Because it's like, I know that shit got under her skin. That's why she wanted to fight me. I didn't say anything about her mom. She just she just got mad. That's all. <laughs> I really don't understand. Like, you can't try to roast a nigga that roast. I roast. I, that's what I do. You can't roast me. Are you crazy? <laughs> like, like I, she, I really had to let her have it, man. Like she needed that though. Some people need that, you know that, you know that reality check. She needed that punch in the face. Like she was like Adrian Broner. I was like man, Marcos Mendana. Like she needed that wake up call. Like you know what I'm saying. I had to wake her ass up because she was getting out of hand. I don't really know if my cousin really told her I'd be saying that or it was she making that up. I'm not sure. My cousin said she didn't say that, so I'm, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take her word for it. But I'm not. I'm really not sure. You know what I'm saying. But that, yeah, that girl really played herself, man. But I, I just can't believe that. And I, and so, so she, she ended up getting like five days ISS. I had to do one day. You know, what I'm saying people was laughing about the shit like that. I, I, I wish it was more people there. I wish, I wish she would have said that shit like in class when it was like twenty some people. It would have really got ugly for her. I actually wish somebody would recorded that shit. That shit would have definitely went on World Star for sure. I wish somebody recorded that shit. But <laughs> if y'all liked it, that story, man, make sure I leave a like. Comment, subscribe. We on this road to 10k. Year. Thanks for fucking with the kid. And no limit, shout them out, man. I always bring y'all stories, man. You know how I do, man. Let's get it.